and on social warfare, Mrs. Ifi Obinabas raised alarm over the high incidence of rape in the state. This was after her visit to an 80-year-old woman who was raped in Okuzu, Oi Council area. Correspondent Chidema Ikanyon completes the report. Mrs. Odina noted that her ministry is out to prosecute sexual offenders and child defilers in the state, warning those who indulge in it and intending offenders to disease forthwith or face the wrong of the government. The commissioner further stated that such act can no longer be tolerated in the state. This is a actually a pathetic story. The woman in question is a poor widow. You can see the kind of business she's into. And where she's living and where she is living. The men went, went to the bush to pick some of these things only for her to meet this kind of terrible thing. Coming out from our youth, a young boy, a young man, it's unacceptable. We can't, we can't keep quiet. The government of Anambra State will not keep quiet. The 80-year-old victim said that she was being pursued by two men on her way from market before she was pushed down, adding that she was surprised to wake up in the hospital. The chairman of Okuzu Vigilante said that they rescued a the man of about 45 years old who was being lynched by the public for the alleged offense. On his part, the suspect, yes. identified as Mr. Chukwemeka, who hails from Ebony State, denied the allegation leveled against him, even though he has admitted being at the woman's house. He, however, contradicted his earlier claims when he said that he pursued the woman because she was a witch and has been holding him from progressing, and that his act is as a result of what his spiritualist told him to do. So, what you Mr. Chukwemeka, who is currently receiving treatment at Omonya, is also kept under close watch and surveillance by the Okuzu Vigilante and the Nigerian Police Force, while Commissioner Obinabo provided everything necessary for the treatment of both the victim and the accused. Okay. From Omonya, Chidimma Ikanyong, ABS News.